<laughs> oh, we are so fortunate that did not happen here, and officials locally say it could have very easily happened. Better safe than sorry. Local 15's Andrea Ramey joins us now from the newsroom. Andrea, Mobile's mayor says it all came down to timing here. Yeah, that's right, Greg. Making that call early, shutting the city down, and getting people home before things got bad. Mayor Sandy Stimson credited Public Works, a department that is not equipped for this kind of extreme winter weather. Crews were out spreading sand on roads, and he says that really did help. Stimson also said the police department and mobile fire rescue were crucial the past few days responding to hundreds of calls. I asked the mayor today how glad is he not to be the mayor of Birmingham or Atlanta, where thousands of people were stranded. Uh, OMG. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I'm glad I'm not there. Yeah, but I mean, could that could that have happened? Oh, here? absolutely. Absolutely. Look at our interstates. Uh, look at uh, I-165. You know, it was uh, ice from the, the Bayway. Yeah, it certainly could. So and that that's a testament to that what our citizens did. You know, we asked them don't drive, and they really responded to that. Baldwin County's EMA director also said today that timing was key. He said warning people early days before it hit and keeping with that message of staying home and off the roads probably saved lives. Live in the newsroom tonight, Andrea Ramey, Local 15 News.